Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can insert units and some parameters in the uh, Kitty Array 5. So a lot of people have been asking me recently uh, about how you can insert units in uh, when you're working with uh, the Kitty Array 5. So let me just show you it's a very easy method to insert the units. So you can actually uh, you don't really have to open up any of the workbench you can go to the uh, tools and options. So anything related to uh, changing the units and changing the different preferences in KTI V5 can be done in this options. So any uh, normal KTI user should really uh, take this options uh, window sometimes and see what is there in it. So I am in the shape option in the digitized uh, shape editor. So you should really minimize this and go to the general tab and maximize the general tab in this way and then go to the parameters and measures so let me just explain you some basics of how to work with this tree over here so maybe in your case uh, the tree might be uh, you know way very small in this way so this is really like the tree which you can see when you're working with the Getty v 5 uh, the inner environment so you can really use the middle mouse button and uh, pan it you can use control and uh, scroll the middle mouse button to uh, zoom it so you know you can uh, scroll it in this way it's just like uh, the tree which you can see in the uh, what do you call the inner environment alright now just come to the parameters and measures and just go to the units in the units you can see length millimeter mm so you can actually change it to kilometers or uh, whatever you want to change it so inches so everything you have all the units so according to your requirement you can change it so in this way all the units which is uh, involved in the working of KTIV5 is all listed over here so you can select the one which you want and just go ahead and click OK and then whatever you create will be uh, set in the units which you have set before in the options so that's all about setting the units and uh, that explains you well how you should work with the units and I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and uh, if you have any doubts any clarifications please feel free to uh, comment on my video and uh, if you have some reference file with which you need to ask the questions you can write to ktia.pro.user at gmail.com catia.pro.user at gmail.com that's all for today and thank you so much and stay tuned